Hi everybody, I'm trying out a new camera today and as you can see I'm in HD which is really really unfortunate now that I think of it because I'm not wearing any makeup and this really really shows the pores. Wow. Anyway, um, so I'm trying to focus on looking at the camera so you can actually see me and I'm not looking down at the computer and just kind of you, know, you can't see me and all you see is the top of my head so it's really hard to focus but anyway I just wanted to tell a little quick story. So last night I was out walking Crash, our dog, who's uh, presently beside me sleeping and snoring. And I, I ran into a couple of neighbors. I, I see them all the time in the window. They'll be in their front porch reading a book or watching, a TV, watching TV or something. And they'll wave at me as I walk by, but they never really come out and talk to me. And I haven't talked to them in several years. So yesterday they were actually outside and they were getting ready to go for a walk. And we kind of crossed paths and I said hello. And, the next thing I know, we're having a, a conversation. We have a conversation for about five or ten minutes or so, at which point one of them says, by the way, and I don't mean for this to sound rude, but who are you? <laughs> at first I thought, well, how could you not? Well, wait, you, you see me, wait, oh. <laughs> So I reintroduced myself to them. I told them about me and they, they made the connection that, oh, wait, so you were, I, I thought you were, I thought you had maybe another, I thought maybe you had a sister and your sister was walking your dog or something. And, uh, and it's funny because I've actually been accused of that one other time. I was in line at a gas station and a, a guy kind of nudges me and goes, hey, do you have an older brother? And I said, well, yeah, I do. He goes, well, I think I know your older brother. We used to work together at this place. And it dawned on me that, no, that's the place that I used to work. And I almost said something that, oh, no, you don't know him. You know me. But again, that same realization kicked in that maybe I don't want to say that in public. Maybe I don't want to, you know, because yeah, I don't know how people are going to react when they realize that. So anyway, it's just kind of nice to be accused of being your own younger sister. That's really funny to me. <laughs> But anyway, we, the neighbors and I, we talked for a few minutes and they were really complimentary and really nice and really sweet. And they, they look forward to seeing me again as we go for our walks. And they're going to make a conscious effort to come out and talk to me a little bit more. And they had some really poignant questions, some really good questions, really good stuff that wasn't uh, overly intrusive, which most people who ask me questions generally ask the ones you just shouldn't ask. And I'm an open book. That's the thing. I don't mind answering the questions, but if you're going to ask the question, you should be prepared for the answer. And a lot of people are just not prepared to have the answer actually given to them. They just want to be able to say they asked the question. And either that or they're just looking for the answer they want and not the answer I give them. But anyway, the, the point is that I, I ran into a couple of neighbors. I had, I had a really good time last night, you know, just chatting with them. And just the whole, who are you? They kind of floored me a little. So I just wanted to pass that along. I hope everybody's having a great day and I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.